activating your Metro SIM card in another phone. Hello everyone. Today, we are going to guide you on how to activate your Metro SIM card in another phone. This is useful in situations where you've gotten a new device or you're temporarily switching to another one. What you need before starting. To begin with, you'll need a few important things. The Metro SIM card you want to activate, the phone you wish to activate the SIM card in, access to a phone or computer with internet connection for the Metro PCS website. Inserting your SIM card into the new phone. Firstly, locate the SIM card slot in your new device. This is usually on the side or at the back of the phone. You might need a SIM card ejector tool to open the tray. Power off your device before you begin. Once the SIM card slot is open, insert your Metro SIM card carefully and then close the slot. Remember, handle your SIM card with care to avoid any damage. Activating your SIM card. After you've inserted the SIM card into the new phone, it's time to activate the SIM card. For this, you need to visit the Metro by T-Mobile website. Go to the Activate section on their homepage. Here, you'll need to enter the necessary details, which typically include your SIM card number and the new phone's IMEI number. This process links your SIM card with your new device. Completing your activation. After entering the required details, you will need to follow the on-screen instructions to complete the activation process. This might include choosing a Metro PCS plan, providing your contact information, confirming your details and finalizing activation. And that's it. You have now learned how to activate your Metro SIM card in another phone. We hope you found this video helpful and easy to follow. Remember, if you encounter any problems during this process, don't hesitate to contact Metro's customer service for further assistance. Happy connecting!